Do you remember the first time you came across Lynn Redgrave? Maybe it was a movie, a play, or a television show that introduced you to her talent and charm. For many, Lynn Redgrave's presence on screen or stage was a delightful revelation, leaving an indelible mark on their entertainment memories. Now, let's take a stroll down memory lane and dive into some random facts about this remarkable actress. Get ready to rediscover Lynn Redgrave's journey and her contributions to the world of entertainment. It's a journey worth reliving, and I'm here to guide you through it, through it, through it. Lynn Redgrave, a remarkable talent Lynn Redgrave, a name synonymous with talent and resilience, left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment through her remarkable career. Born on March 8, 1943, in London, England, Lynn was destined for greatness as a member of the renowned Redgrave acting dynasty. Yet, her journey through the tumultuous waters of the entertainment industry was a unique and awe-inspiring one. While her surname carried immense weight in the world of theater and film, Lynn managed to carve out her own distinctive niche. She possessed a rare ability to effortlessly transition between comedy and drama, a skill that earned her widespread acclaim. Her magnetic stage presence and infectious wit endeared her to both audiences and critics alike. Lynn's career began in the early 1960s when she made her London stage debut in A Midsummer Night's Dream. However, it was her role in the film Georgie Girl that catapulted her to international fame. Her portrayal of the lovable and slightly awkward Georgie earned her an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress. This recognition was just the beginning of a prolific career that spanned five decades. One of the lesser-known aspects of Lynn's life was her unwavering commitment to social and political causes. She was an outspoken advocate for women's rights, mental health awareness, and the LGBTQ community long before such issues gained mainstream acceptance. Lynn's courage in addressing these topics during a time when many chose to remain silent demonstrated her immense character and integrity. In addition to her acting prowess, Lynn Redgrave was also a gifted writer. She penned several plays and memoirs, including Shakespeare for My Father, a poignant exploration of her complex relationship with her father, Sir Michael Redgrave, and the Shakespearean legacy that bound them. Despite her numerous achievements, Lynn faced her fair share of personal challenges. Her battle with breast cancer in the late 2000s seconds was a testament to her resilience. Throughout her illness, she continued to perform on stage, displaying a strength of spirit that inspired many. Lynn Redgrave's contributions to the world of entertainment and her tireless advocacy for important social issues make her a true icon. Her magnetic talent, unwavering principles, and captivating performances continue to inspire generations of actors and artists to this day. In May 2010, the world lost Lynn Redgrave, but her legacy lives on. Her life and work serve as a testament to the enduring power of art and the human spirit. Lynn Redgrave, a woman of immense talent, passion, and courage, will forever be remembered as a shining star in the constellation of Hollywood legends. Wood legends. Wood legends. Lynn Redgrave, a renowned actress, is known for her remarkable career in the entertainment industry. One notable milestone in her career was her appearance in the film Everything You Always Wanted to Know About Sex in 1972. The film, inspired by Dr. David Rubin's sex manual, tackled various humorous and unconventional aspects of human sexuality. Lynn Redgrave, alongside her sister Vanessa Redgrave, graced the cover of Time magazine on March 17, 1967. This cover feature came shortly after both sisters received Oscar nominations for their outstanding performances in Georgie Girl and Morgan, a suitable case for treatment in 1966, showcasing their talent and recognition in the film industry. This intriguing moment in Lynn Redgrave's career and her participation in a film exploring the complex topic of human sexuality contribute to her legacy as a versatile and influential actress. actress, actress. Lynn Redgrave, a talented actress with a notable cinematic lineage, had a significant presence in the world of film. She, her mother Rachel Kempson, and her two siblings, Vanessa Redgrave and Corin Redgrave, all contributed to movies that clinched the prestigious Academy Award for Best Picture. Rachel Kempson appeared in Tom Jones and Out of Africa. Lynn herself graced the screen in Tom Jones, while Vanessa and Corin played roles in A Man for All Seasons. In addition to her cinematic achievements, Lynn Redgrave played notable roles in films like Kinsey, where she portrayed the character Final Interview Subject. 
Her versatility as an actress was further exemplified by her portrayal of the Queen in another production. Beyond her acting career, Lynn Redgrave faced personal challenges, including a battle with breast cancer. Following her diagnosis and treatment, she co-authored the book journal, A Mother and Daughter's Recovery from Breast Cancer with her daughter, Annabel Clark, and Baron Lerner. This work provided an intimate look into her journey and her determination to overcome adversity. Lynn Redgrave's contributions to film and her courage in the face of personal trials leave a lasting legacy in the world of entertainment and beyond. Lynn Redgrave, a notable figure in the world of entertainment, had her share of intriguing moments throughout her life. One of those moments occurred in 2006 in Manteo, NC. While the details are limited, it's known that she was involved in an event or project in this North Carolina town during that year, adding a touch of mystery to her legacy. In another interesting collaboration, Lynn Redgrave partnered with her photographer daughter, Annabel Clark. Together, they co-published a work titled R. This joint venture showcased their creative talents and the special bond they shared as mother and daughter. Additionally, in 1976, Lynn Redgrave made waves when she appeared in Alexander Cohen's revival of H-E-L-L-Z-A-P-O-P-P-I and in Boston. It was during this production that she forged a romantic relationship with Brandon Maddard, a fellow actor in the cast. Their love story added a personal dimension to her career illustrating the complexities of life in the world of theater. While these facts shed light on some intriguing aspects of Lynn Redgrave's life and career, much more could be said about this talented actress and her contributions to the world of entertainment. Lynn Redgrave's legacy continues to be remembered and celebrated in various forms, leaving an indelible mark on the industry. Industry, industry, industry. Lynn Redgrave, controversial exit from house calls in 1981 and 1981. Actress Lynn Redgrave found herself in the midst of a public dispute with Universal Studios over her departure from the CBS series House Calls. While Universal Studios claimed it was due to salary demands, Redgrave had a different story. According to People magazine, Redgrave asserted that she was forced off the TV show because she wanted to breastfeed her five-week-old daughter on set. This claim was met with denial from Universal Studios, which stated that the issue was about salary negotiations. However, an interesting twist to the story emerged with a phone call transcript recorded by Pete Terranova, a negotiator for Universal at the time. In the transcript, Terranova was heard saying that the breastfeeding matter was the biggest problem of all for us. This statement suggested that Redgrave's desire to breastfeed may have indeed played a significant role in her departure from the show. This controversy shed light on the challenges faced by working mothers in the entertainment industry at the time. It raised questions about the industry's willingness to accommodate the needs of mothers with young children and the negotiation dynamics between actors and studios. While the exact details of Lynn Redgrave's exit from house calls may never be fully resolved, the incident remains a notable chapter in her career and a point of discussion regarding the intersection of motherhood and show business. Show business. Show business. Lynn Redgrave, the accomplished actress, had a notable career and some intriguing quirks. One such curiosity was her association with the anti-EGOT. This term refers to individuals who have been nominated for all four major entertainment awards but never won any. Lynn Redgrave received nominations for the Oscars in 1966 and 1998, Tony Awards in 1976, 1993, and 2006, Primetime and Daytime Emmy Awards in 1981 and 1983, and the Grammy in 2007, yet she never clinched any of these prestigious honors. Another noteworthy aspect of her life was her connection with her elder brother Corin Redgrave. Tragically, Lynn passed away less than a month after her brother Corin Redgrave's death. This poignant timing highlighted the close bond they shared as siblings. Apart from these facts, Lynn Redgrave made her mark in the entertainment industry, notably appearing in the 1966 film Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, which gained widespread acclaim. Her performances, although not always leading to awards, left an indelible impact on the world of entertainment. In conclusion, Lynn Redgrave's career and life were marked by remarkable achievements and intriguing circumstances, from her anti-EGOT status to her close connection with her brother. Her contributions to the world of acting and film remain memorable. Lynn Redgrave, a renowned actress known for her talent and contributions to the entertainment industry, has left a lasting legacy.
Here are some interesting facts about her final resting place. Lynn Redgrave was laid to rest on May 8, 2010 at St. Peter's Cemetery in Lithgow, New York, USA. Notably, this is the same burial site where her mother, Rachel Kempson, and her niece, Natasha Richardson, were also interred. At her funeral, her sister Vanessa Redgrave, niece Jolie Richardson, along with actors Brendan Fraser and Liam Neeson, paid their respects. The Lost Colony, Lynn Redgrave portrayed Queen Elizabeth I in the Lost Colony outdoor drama during the summer. Her versatile acting skills allowed her to take on various roles, even historical ones. Namesake, Lynn Redgrave was named after the famous actress Lynn Fontaine, showcasing her family's strong connection to the world of theater. Lynn Redgrave's life and career were marked by her dedication to her craft and her family's deep roots in the world of acting. Her final resting place, her portrayal of Queen Elizabeth I, and her namesake all serve as testaments to her enduring impact on the entertainment industry. This concise look at Lynn Redgrave's life and contributions is, contributions is, contributions is. As we bid adieu to this journey through the remarkable career of Lynn Redgrave, I invite you to take a moment to delve into the recesses of your own memory. Perhaps you've been touched by her boundless talent and captivating performances. As you reflect, consider the indelible mark Lynn has left on the world of entertainment. Her ability to effortlessly transition between drama and comedy to inhabit a myriad of characters with unwavering authenticity is an artistry that lingers in the hearts of audiences worldwide. Whether it was her acclaimed roles on stage, her memorable appearances on screen, or her eloquent words on the page, Lynn Redgrave possessed a rare gift, the ability to stir our emotions, challenge our perspectives, and make us laugh, cry, and think. Now, it's your turn to share. We'd love to hear your cherished memories, your favorite scenes, or the performances that have stayed with you over the years. Lynn's legacy is not only shaped by her incredible body of work, but also by the connection she forged with each and every one of you. So, take a moment to pay tribute to this extraordinary talent by sharing your thoughts and memories. Your voice adds another layer to the rich tapestry of Lynn Redgrave's influence on the world of entertainment. In closing, we extend our heartfelt gratitude to you for joining us in celebrating Lynn Redgrave's impactful journey. Together, we remember and honor the indomitable spirit that she brought to the stage and screen. Thank you for your time, your interest, and your contributions to this tribute.